Good morning. I'm so excited to be here today. Thanks to the organizer and uh, thanks for your attention. So let me introduce Hoji Agricultural Science and Technology. So this talk will have three parts. First, the market demand, then product description, finally our team introduction. So what we do is we collect meteorology data, satellite remote sensing data, soil data, hydrology data, and generate a crop growth model. This model can predict crop growth and help agricultural finance. The market demand is huge. Uh, at least the three most important area. The first area is scale agriculture. The second one is uh, government. The third one is agricultural insurance. If you look at this number, they are very huge. Next, our product description. We use two different technology. First one is machine learning. From machine learning, we use a lot of data and get machine learning model. The second model is a crop system model. This is a physical model. Both of these models can predict crop growth and uh, help reduce cost and uh, increase output. So look at this graph. The left side is the data we need. The right side is the result. Based on the data on the left, we have a different uh, management. So here we have six different uh, management. We have six different uh, results. So, so we implement our technology to a web-based uh, data-driven application. It receives GIS satellite data and ground sensor data automatically. It gives suggestion and prediction of curve growth. It can also provide a forewarning message of disease and pests. So our website can also optimize crop species choice, estimate agriculture insurance for different farmland. We can also confirm of land rights and assist, in the, and assist the agriculture poverty elevation. The advantage of us, we use both uh, physical model and machine learning model. We have in-depth cooperation with Zeming University of China and UC Davis. We also have close operation with China Fruit Shield Agriculture Base and the Bloom Sky Sensor Company. There is no unicorn company in this market of China. In US, the climate Cooperation is acquired by Monsanto for $1 million. Next is our team introduction. Dao Yuan Jing and me work for R&D side. Dong Peng, Li Teng work for the market team. Most of us have a PhD degree. Thank you. As I said, it's uh, First is the agricultural insurance company. We can predict the crop growth, so we can give them a number about how much insurance money for this farmland. So which means you provide the data analysis to the insurance company, Yes. Uh, especially those insurance companies who insure the land crops yes. in China? Yes. Okay. And uh, have you talked with any insurance company yet in China? Uh, we willing have. We we talked with several of them. And willing to pay you? Uh, it's still in negotiation. Okay, so in China, uh, mm -hmm. the land is on. Let's say I'm the farmer, right? Mm -hmm. I farm, and then do I can I purchase the insurance from the local insurance company to protect my 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 risk? Uh, in China, most area no. So, so, th so there is a. It's a big. Uh, Market. So which means even the insurance doesn't insure the uh, interest of the farmers. Yes. They, they mm. haven't done that yet. N no. So how, how they can pay you the, to do that part? Uh, uh, the first part we only work for large scale agriculture, large farmers. 
like a uh, corporate, like a corporate farmers. Uh, yeah, kind of like that. Okay. Next um, step, we will uh, work for a more smaller uh, land. Okay, and you, and. Yeah. Um, where do you get your data today? Uh, we get data from the main University of the UC Davis. Is it real-time data or? Yeah, it's real-time data. And that's covering China and the U.S. together. U.S. US. Only U.S. right now. So your data comes from the U.S. market, but yes. your 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 and your uh, target market is going to be in China. So what's going to be that for? Because there's two countries. Have yeah, but, but the model can use both in U.S. and uh, China. But then, but mm. the data was different because in China, like for example, again, like the U.S. L more land is a huge, and in China uh, it's not that huge. Yes, but the size doesn't matter. We uh, we we predict the crop growth for different uh, area, but it, it's like a poor uh, kilometer square. Mm -hmm. What 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 it will be? What's our product? We predicted this. But I thought that data source mm -hmm. should be coming from China because you're serving China market. Is there two, two different yeah, cultures? Yes, two but, different markets. But, but in China, there are not much sensor. Correct, in the US, yes. there are a lot of sensors. So, so it's very easy to get data from here. So which does this mean that's too early for you to tailor to target the China market because there's no s data? We will apply both sensor and uh, the data. We will give sensor to them. And uh, uh, in, in China, there is a, right now there is no competition. But what will prevent those companies penetrating China? Why, why they need a Chinese company to do it? I mean, there are companies who are doing the same thing. Uh, because uh, I, I think uh, it's a safety, safety reason. I don't think uh, Chinese government will use uh, U.S. company. Mm -hmm. It's like a trade war, you know. It's so how much, how much money are you raising, and what are you going to do with it? Uh, we'd like to raise uh, two to three million dollars at so this stage. Can you give me a number? Uh, not, not a range. Give me a number, and tell me what you're going to do with it. Uh, uh, three million dollars. OK. <laughs> Very good choice. <laughs> so now what are you going to do with that money? Uh, we will hire people and uh, place sensors Ground. In China? In China. Okay, so this speaks to your question about how they're going to get to China, I hope. The data. Uh, so, uh. so what is the new outcome that you're going to create for your customers and for your investors? Uh, we increase the product for uh, carbs. This is the first part. Second part is the, the agriculture insurance. Uh, 